Hi, here's a short video of a modification I've made to my Skywalker X7. I've made a 360 degree camera mount. Um, I've taken exactly the same design from uh, David on flight test, so follow those instructions uh, and you'll be able to make something like this. It's pretty simple. Uh, I've made one exception, I've put the server more underneath. Uh, than David's design just to make it a little bit less, well, a little bit smaller so it can fit on the canopy a little bit better and I've used one a plastic spacer that I just had found uh, that I found in my uh, tool drawer and I've put a uh, ball bearing inside to, uh, to make it a bit more stable uh, I've also fitted a circularly, uh, a circular polarized lens because I've started to fly over some lakes now so uh, if you're interested in a video about that then just uh, just let me know and I can post one up soon. Uh, this 360 degree mount, I'd really recommend if you've got something like this to do something uh, like this. It's, uh, it, it produces some really nice videos and you can really have a nice look around. It's connected to the rudder channel so just turn the rudder all the way around and you can look around to the back and if you let go of the rudder it just self-centers itself as the design should be. It's using uh, an external uh, uh, potentiometer. Um, again, I, I bought all of the, the same servo, the same potentiometer, the same gears and everything like that as in the instructions that uh, David for flight testers has put together and uh, I had no problem. What I did do is I went to a local um, uh, RC uh, hobby store and uh, I got these uh, aluminium threaded couplers um, and I used what I did was on, on the external potentiometer uh, what I did was I used my grinder to, to grind it down a little bit um, and then I managed to uh, fit the external potentiometer in here and then be able to, to mount the cover on top so yeah, that was the simplest way of doing that for me. So, uh, yeah, if you've got an X7 or an X8 or something as big as this and, and you've got the weight to be able to take care of uh, a 360 degree pan, then, uh, yeah, you should uh, make yourself one of these. Cheers.